<laughs> what is up, Doodlebugs? I hope you had an amazing week. It's been a while. So much has happened. So many things have been going on locally, globally. But most importantly, I got a brand new coffee maker and it's amazing. Mmm. Mmm. Poofta. In case you missed it on my main channel, I had a double dual delicious collaboration going on with the guys from Convos with my two-year-old. I put a new super powered video on my main channel and then on their channel, I did an illustration of the story of Tony. It was fun. It was phenomenal. It was a very long three weeks. I do this to myself every single time. I start a project and I say, hey, myself in the future, I'm gonna make this a very simple project. It's not gonna be complicated and you won't lose sleep or be pulling your hair out or screaming or crying in the next three weeks. I guarantee you. And then I just, ugh. it's tragic how easily I lie to myself about these things. It was great. I think the big glitch was a technical one. In the end, it turns out my laptop, God bless her, she has seen a lot of projects. She's done a lot of work, needs a little R&R, &R, a little cleanup. She was struggling with just editing these files. So the Super Powered series is an animatic. It's not technically animation. It's all about telling a story through still pictures. And so, I was gonna draw these pictures digitally with my digital drawing equipment I spent a lot of money on. And then, of course, it didn't, it wasn't working. It was going so slow, so slow. And again, they used the computer, but I ended up just throwing my hands up and saying, you know what, I'll do it traditional. Let's do it pencil to paper and just get it done. I have, where, here you are, so many drawings, so much paper. This is like, 60 pages at least and some of these pages have uh, two drawings on them. Yeah, it was most mostly hand-drawn. Not saying digital art isn't hand-drawn when you have a tablet that, that that's in a sense hand-drawn. People like to debate whether or not digital art is actually art, which is silly. It is art. It's just a whole nother medium that you're using. Blah, 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 blah. Bleh. End debate. So last week we finished up the collaboration, finally got that uploaded. I was on YouTube Nation a week ago exactly. It was amazing. I felt very honored to be on the show. Their shooting space is super cool. In such a beautiful environment. They had a wall right in front of their elevators that says, please draw on me. <sighs> I was the jerk who went up to the wall and said, oh, you want me to draw on you? And then I just took up all the space that others could have had to sign their names and whatnot. I'm an awful human. <laughs> and, and the most important news, I got a new family member. Hello! <laughs> I got a new puppet. It was an impulse buy. Hello, YouTube. <laughs> ah. If you follow me on Twitter, there was a road twip, road twip tweet session. <laughs> yes. I got a dinosaur puppet. She needs a name. So if you want to help me pick a name, uh, go ahead and tweet suggestions at me at Mary Doodles. And next week, we will name her. It's so sad, you don't have a name. What if something happened to you? What do I put on your gravestone? <gasps> Thank you very much for watching. Please share, like, fave, subscribe, and uh, if you think of a name for me, please comment below. I could eat you all day. And of course, when Russian police officers arrive to find a naked man with his hmm, pinned to the what, the first thing they do is throw a blanket on him. The apathy of Russian politics. And they couldn't get him off the pavement until the paramedics arrived, because who wants to troubleshoot that one?